Hey guys, it's January 7271. I'm uh, in downtown Troy. I've been to two different farmers markets. One was kind of lame. I did pick up some corn, um, a dozen ears of corn for a barbecue that we're having tomorrow. And uh, I picked up, I forget what else, the, the smaller one. But there is one in downtown Troy from Saturday, on Saturday mornings from 9 a.m. to noon that has approximately 30 vendors. Considering Troy's less than 30,000 people, that's not too bad. And some of the vendors who are coming in is from as far away as Bell Fountain, which is about 40 miles away. So this is kind of a big deal for them, I guess. And, and it was packed. So I bought, uh, I don't know, the one, the smaller one was definitely more expensive. Uh, they wanted a dollar a piece for the zucchini and uh, it was kind of on the small side the zucchini I ended up getting was from the bigger market and it was two for a dollar so if you don't have a garden it's going to cost you um, we'll chunk up some of the zucchini and dehydrate it and put it uh, put it in uh, not freezer bags but vac seal bags for future use uh, and soups or stews or whatever so um, it was a pretty good day all in all I didn't spend that much time shopping because you know even though there's 30 vendors a lot of them weren't food related vendors they were arts and crafts stuff so you can move pretty quickly um, if that's if you're not into that sort of stuff all right well um, this is my report from the Miami County Farmers Markets um, I guess we're going to try to hit the Covington one and the Tip City one next weekend. So uh, we'll get this right before the end of summer and hopefully have a, a bunch of stuff for the dehydrator and the canner. Um, hopefully with any luck later today or later this weekend or during the week we're going to be canning um, some chicken and some ground beef. So hey, stay tuned, stay prepped. Bye.